hello friends uh, welcome back um, in this video I'm going to show you how we can create an age field for uh, the cases you know uh, we get to calculate uh, how many days or hours or uh, you know uh, elapsed since the case has been created so uh, this is basically formula field which we show you like how many hours or days uh, elapsed since the case has been created which you can use it for various other uh, purposes or you know various other uh, functionality to you know display either to display or to you know calculate some functionality so uh, let's go ahead and see how we can do that so first I'll go ahead and create a uh, this is the case object I'll go ahead and create a new formula field it's pretty simple uh, to calculate the age uh, let me show you So select formula and then give field label let's case age okay and let's make it a number since we are going to show it in hours so we can keep a decimal number if you want to show minutes or you can make it zero so let's make it zero and see how it comes out Okay, the editor has come formula editor let's go ahead and calculate the age now minus let's insert the field on which the case was created date and time opened which is nothing but the created date and okay let's see how this comes out after that you can edit and see you know how it is coming out either hours days okay so no errors let's go ahead and save it okay, select profile whichever you you want and also the page layout i'll uh, add it to all of them okay so new formula field is created so let's go ahead and see how it's coming out so i just added a new case today just now to test this let's see how it is coming up for this okay the case h is zero because i just created few minutes back so it's obviously it is zero because so uh, no not it, it, it will be in hours so it will become one after one hour similarly I have one more case here let me refresh this and let's see what is the case age this is 578 it means it's sorry it's in days not in hours so it's 578 days since the case has been created so if you can see the date time opened it sometime in 2017 let me show you uh, the exact difference so i have the same date set here 2nd october 2017 to today is 3rd may 2019 so if i calculate 578 days so this is correct so it's 578 days of the case age so now let's see how we can you know uh, see in hours let's uh, modify this formula a bit and see how it comes out so now what we'll do is we'll multiply it by 24 let's check the syntax Okay, all good and let's refresh this so this 578 days now it should show in hours okay let's refresh it again did I save it oh sorry I think I haven't saved it
okay save was successful let's refresh now this should show me in hours so now you can see it is in hours 13867 hours since the you know last issue since the date it was created so similarly we can see uh, the one which I recently created, I think it will show zero for that as well. Yeah, it is zero. Let's see if I have any newly created case. I'll sort by okay. I have one uh, which is created a couple of days back. Okay, 72. So, 72 hours since the uh, last case was created. Last, this case was created in 30th April 2019. So, you know, this is how you can, you know, calculate the age in simple ways. There will be more even complex ways. You know, if you want to show all the, you know, number of days, uh, number of uh, days hours minutes it will be complex formula but you know it's always good to start with something simple and you can you know optimize for that to uh, suit your needs okay so that's all from my side uh, do let me know if you have any questions in the comments i'll try to answer as much as possible and uh, please do subscribe to my channel i'll be posting uh, more videos on any uh, requirement which i face and I found something new. So thanks for watching. Bye-bye.